What is up, YouTube? Today I'm going to be talking about um, some more uh, land and beautiful sights to see in Tennessee. Uh, whether you're from visiting from out of state, if you're a resident here, just get out and experience the great outdoors and what Tennessee has to offer. Um, so what I'm going to be talking about today is why you should go check out Cheatham uh, Wildlife Management Area in Tennessee. It's near Nashville, so uh, many people uh, know about this one. Um, but definitely if you're from out of state, uh, this one might be one to check out. Um, so Cheatham WMA um, is a massive 20,000 acre uh, public land managed by Tennessee Wildlife Resources Agency. Offers some great public land hunting, uh, some beautiful sites, and uh, offers a range and even has ATV access roads, uh, trails uh, during certain seasons that you can use. Uh, so definitely good there. Um, and with this, uh, you know, just beautiful public land, uh, that Tennessee makes sure that you have from paying those, uh, hunting license fees. So, uh, definitely goes towards conserving this great land. Um, so recently my, me and my brother, uh, went turkey hunting there. Um, so what we did was we went on on X. Uh, many of you know that hunt, that hunting app, uh, we picked a place that would probably, uh, be good if we found a place to park uh, on there and we picked a time and so we went uh, actually on a Saturday morning uh, which if you've seen, read anything on the forums Facebook groups people actually say no don't go on a Saturday there it's more hunters than you could ever imagine and we'll get on to that I was talking about if we saw a bunch of hunters um, things like that um, so we you know we just found a little place decided we would go for a couple hours see what we would uh, experience there because we've heard a lot of negative things about it and we were actually pretty surprised that it was a pretty nice place um, it is a lot of upland forest uh, so it's a lot of downhill uphill a lot of strenuous hiking be prepared for uh, but the sites you'll see are very worth it um, uh, throughout this video you'll see um, basically some overlooks uh, creeks ponds um, you know some awesome sites and it's, it's definitely worth it um, so we saw um, some spring flowers as well because we went, uh, you know, spring turkey season in April, uh, some spring mushrooms. Um, so, yeah, it was definitely, definitely great. Uh, you know, birds chirping, um, great sights. And it, it was just a really fun experience even just being out there. Uh, you know, it's great. Tennessee offers these great public lands for hunters to use. And um, I know that some of the other states might not offer uh, such good land. Uh so getting down to the turkey hunting, um, we actually didn't see any turkeys. We spent uh, about five to six hours out in the woods. Uh, we covered maybe three to four miles. Um, and we didn't see any turkeys. We did uh, hear some calls here and there, uh, but they're probably from nearby hunters. We didn't see any other hunters actually. And we actually went three weeks into the season. So that could have played a role that a lot of people just went the first couple weeks in the season. Um, but we actually still went on a weekend day. Saturday morning, you would have thought it would have been packed, but we did not see anyone else. We did hear a few other calls that were probably from other hunters, a couple of crow calls that you could tell kind of weren't probably a real crow when they were trying to locate a turkey. Uh, but yeah, it wasn't on top of hunters. Like if you, you read these forms and they say, oh, that you'll be on top of a hunter. There's more hunters than animals out there. And that may be true, especially the first week or two in the season, but uh, from our experience, that wasn't the case. Uh, so we definitely recommend to go out there and check it out for yourself. Um, and another thing that could have played a role in that is maybe we just parked on the opposite side of the WMA that everyone else does. Um, we don't we don't know why that why that was when we've everything we've heard is that's super packed. Um, but we highly recommend checking out this property, uh, whether you're a beginner or expert, um, because if you're an expert. You're going to know what to look for. You're going to get to experience this beautiful land. And if you're a beginner, uh, you're going to get out there, get experience, and get to experience the beautiful land as well. Um, and from Harvest Records, there's some animals out there. Um, if you just go out there and, you know, put in work and try to find them and uh, gain that experience, there's animals out there. Look at the Harvest Records. Um, so I would say go experience it for yourself before believing the Debbie Downers. And yeah, we pay we pay these hunting fees. Let's uh, conserve our public lands and make sure we get good use out of them. And yeah, so go check it out.